Hello, this week we will see with you how you can dribble like Messi. What makes Messi special friends? Of course, he is very smart and very intelligent. Does he make fancy moves while dribbling? No, he doesn't. So where does Messi show the difference? In changing his speed mates. Messi is a very beautiful p- football player with very strong timing. If you pay attention while dribbling, he always dribbles the ball in the same style. But what we see when we analyze Messi's dribbling is that he uses the mo- moment when the defender falls into gap very carefully and very effectively. He slows down the game and after a while he speeds up. The defender is already behind him or passing or just watching Messi. Of course he is a very talented footballer but there are very valuable points you can learn from him. There are very simple key points friends. I recommend you to watch a lot of football matches and pay attention to Messi's movements. If I need to tell you the important points in Messi's dribbling, first thing changing his speed. Change your speed while dribbling. Do not dribble at a fixed speed friends. This will cause the defender to understand you very easily. So play with your speed. You will go from slow to fast while dribbling. Second thing, slow down the game after going from slow to fast. What does this cause? What does it cause? It causes the defender to fall into a gap, which is a very valuable moment. When you slow down while dribbling, the defender's free moment is when you accelerate. So it's not the point where you feel the best. You need to change your speed at the defender's free moment. So analyzing the opponent is always the key point. Never forget this, friends. Third point, you dribble the ball towards the defense from slow to fast. So what are you going to do next? You have increased your speed. If you are going to the right, you will go left. If you are going to the left, you will go to the right. Another important point is changing direction, friends. Changing direction is something that comes very easily to the lab. However, it is not so easy on the field and in front of the opponent. So I recommend you to practice a lot. What are you going to do after you pass the defense? You need to make a big touch on the ball with a big kick. Make the ball go before you. When the ball goes before you, you will catch up with the ball. And in the meantime, what the defender can you do is to foul you. If he maximum lucky, when he maneuvers, you will ensure that the ball stays in your possession after the foul. What I can tell you as a bonus, friends, wait for the defender to get the ball from you. Wait to win. But really this is an advanced level. In order to do this, you need to improve your movement, your opponent, your dominance a lot. Of course you can earn this by working a lot, by practicing. I repeat the key point you need when you try to dribble like Messi. It is not the little touches. Your speed is very important. The change of speed is going to, from slow to fast. It is important that you catch the defender's moment of gap, the moment when the footballer, the defender falls into gap in your key point, rather than when you feel right. You should be able to act there and then of course with the change of direction you pass the defender and throw the ball forward with a big touch and then you go to the ball. I believe you will be successful. Success comes with plenty of practice. Believe. Have confidence in yourself. Good luck. Video is over. What do we do now? We subscribe to the channel and invite our friends to Turkey's first and only online football school. See you soon.